Hey everyone, I also make a little video now about victimhood versus being the creator of our life. Um, a little reminder to say a lot of people go around being the victim, but I want to say you're the creator of your day. Your life is today, by the way, and your life is even right now in this moment. So that's all your life ever is. It's not this week, month or year. It's this day and even more specifically just right now. So if you, no matter what's happened in your life, you're sick, lost your money, lost your health, had an argument, feeling lonely, sad or depressed or anxious, you can change all that right now and right today. One little step at a time, one choice and decision and focus at a time, okay? So it's really, really simpler than you probably think. I want you to claim, in this video, I want you to claim back your power in life. I want you to start taking responsibility. Know that your choices and decisions have made your life today, okay? Um, so no matter what's happened, it's not so much exactly what's happened, it's what's, how you've responded or reacted to what's happened. In all of the aspects I mentioned before and everything else, work, place of living, family, friends, career, relationships, health, ha everything, okay? So all your happiness and stress can be changed to be more on the higher vibrational path. So in this video, I want you to claim responsibility and accountability for your actions and the cause and effect, the effect of your actions and choices, okay? And I want you to start change, like creating your day, like being the creator and being the co-creator with other people. So get, I want you to get happy, get the, make the most of life and seize the moment, be happy. So if you're finding it very difficult to like be happier, the number one thing you need to do is change your thoughts one little bit at a time to it, like higher frequency or vibration. So less depressive victim thoughts, more accountability, responsibility thoughts. And that includes stuff like saying sorry, um, making amends for your mistakes, owning up to your mistakes, realizing your mistakes, learning from your mistakes. Okay, so that's one factor. The next factor is follow your truth. So start, stop betraying and abandoning yourself and your truth and living for other people, what they want and expect or demand from you. Of course, live from your heart and be kind and caring when it's good, generally speaking, so to speak, like without exhausting and depleting yourself. But start doing your passions, your calling, your interests, your hobbies, your gifts, your creativity, your creative outlets, your expressions, your expression of words, singing, humming, dancing, moving, talking, creating relationships, creativity and art, which is art and creativity in itself, creating relationships, creating words, poetry, writing, YouTubing, talking, um, drawing, painting, walking, dressing, not dressing, everything is how you do your home, how you how you invite somebody, your your invitations, your gifts, all of these are creative expressions, okay? So express yourself. Music, songs, musical instruments, art, anything. So how you talk to people. So in this video I want you to start following your truth and taking and growing up and taking responsibility. And if you start doing that, that's like 90% of the job done. So being honest with yourself, and that that will also allow you to like cry and to heal, and to learn from your mistakes, and then you keep learning and growing like at a continuous like like basically an uphill like even if it's like swerves a downhill a little bit, but basically just continuously uphill you're gonna learn. So. Yeah, that's what I want in, for you in this video, to take responsibility to, to, to create your life, to create your day and to be excited about your life and to have fun and enjoy yourself in all areas that I mentioned before, every single area, sexual expression to everything, everything. So life isn't as hard as we often think, we just live on a very dense planet but a lot of light and lightness also, but uh, mixed in is the denseness to help us to grow and learn and to like, have have fun, give us a challenge. But that doesn't mean we have to be a victim, we can actually be the creator. So in this video, like the beautiful apple tree, I want you to be like a creator, you know? Just like live more in the flow, natural free flow. Don't like let go of the stagnations and blockages. And um, check out this video about like 10 tips to heal from depression and feeling down. That, that gives like more tips and advice. Um, other than that, I'm have a lovely day and
thanks for your shares I love it when you like share the video and I look I have fun and enjoy your comments also so if you want to do that I much appreciate it and other than that I'll see you again in another video and have a have a nice day everybody look after yourself and each other bye